Hi everyone, it's Ruby, and today in this video, I'm going to be showing you my whole day of getting braces on. If you didn't already know, then I'm actually getting braces on tomorrow, which is Thursday tomorrow, and today is Wednesday night, it's eight o'clock right now, and I thought, why not pull up the camera and bring you guys along with me while I get my braces on? I put a Instagram story up a minute ago asking you guys what color I should get on my braces because I still haven't decided. I'm actually gonna read out some of the col colors you guys said now. A lot of you said purple, a lot of you said like grayish purple. So I think that kind of made my mind up. I think I'm gonna go with like a lilac color. Or silver, Rayleigh is going for silver. But I think I'm gonna go for lilac because I feel like it's a really pretty color and it is my favorite color. Tomorrow I'm waking up and then nine o'clock I have a class till half 11 and then I have to do some homework and have my lunch and then at 15 past two I have my orthodontist and I'm getting braces on first. And then Rayleigh has hers three till four. I'm kind of excited to be honest because it's gonna straighten up my teeth but I'm also a little bit nervous. But you know, I'm gonna go to bed now and get an early night. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi everyone, so I just woke up, the time is half seven. I forgot my Florence by Mills lip balm, which I'm using all the time, especially today because this my mouth's gonna be open a lot for them to put the braces on. I don't wanna have like chapped lips, which I always have. I talked to my friend, she has braces, and she said it, take, it took her about 20 minutes to get them on, so it's not that long. Thank you to everybody who responded to my story last night. A lot of you said the colour lilac or light blue or light pink, but I looked last time when I went to the Orthodontist and I can't even remember what colours they had, to be honest. I don't know if they had those colours, but they'll tell me when I'm in there and I'll just make a decision on the spot, probably. Okay, so basically, I just put a fake tan on my face. I know it really would right now, but it will... I'll get better. I use this one and it's kind of like a makeup one I guess you could say and I think you have to leave it like an hour and then wash it off but I know and it's really weird. <laughs> okay so I just got the bath I just put on a jumper Ooh. and my hair's soaking wet which is like the back of my head but I'm going to go have breakfast now. Well shreddy is here and that is my breakfast. Okay, so I just finished breakfast and I'm in my room. I'm just gonna put my hair in a little bump because it's wet. <laughs> and my class starts in 10 minutes, so I'm just upstairs and I'm just gonna set up for the class because I need to get my books out, my pen. <laughs> English book is here. And the class always opens five minutes early, so I like to join it five minutes early. I'm gonna write English. I'm gonna get on with my lesson now. I have done a video showing you my whole day of like working all that, so I'm not gonna do that today. I'll see you on my breakers, which is at 10 until half 10. So I'll see you at 10 o'clock. So I have a half an hour break till half 10. And my hair's like damp, I guess you could say. So what I'm gonna do now is so it's like wavy. I'm going to get some lesson bands and I'm gonna do my hair in some plaits. I'll go back on my call for another hour and then I'll do some homework and get ready. The thing is, people feel a lot of different ways about getting braces. Like, I don't mind. I, I like, I've never really been bothered about it. I don't mind if I have to get them. I don't mind if I don't have to get them. My friend who has braces didn't mind either. I just, it doesn't really bother me to be honest. If it makes my teeth straighter, then I'll get them. If there's like a light purple or light blue or light pink, I'll go for one of them, I think. I just did my hair in some plaits. I was gonna do French parts, but then I decided they would take longer. So I've just kind of put them in some low braids because my room's a little bit messy. I'm gonna clean it now. So this is my room right now. It's not messy, but it's not clean. Okay, so now I've cleaned it up a little bit. So I'm going to choose out my outfit for the day now and then put it on after my class. I've just got this top and it's see-through, so I have to put something underneath it. So I've got this like really cute white vest I got in Ruby and Rayleigh video. And then I just got some classic joggers. I got a orange and some water in my chilies bottle. I just finished my class. So a lot of you said baby pink, baby blue, lilac, light pink, 
blue or white. I'm not going to get white. I'm not going to get transparent. Because I've heard that the yellow, if you get yellow and white, they're just the worst colours you can get. Um, like blue, teal, peach. That's nice, actually. So I'm thinking, I actually don't know the colours they have there. So when I'm there, I'll look and decide. But I did search up the UK braces colours. These are the colours. Literally, there's so many. Uh, I'm thinking light pink, light blue, or light purple. All I'm thinking is I should take lip balm because my mouth's going to be open for ages. Apparently, they put one of those mouth guard things in your mouth, which, like, keep it open. Ugh, I hate people touching my mouth. <laughs> I have my lunch. It's actually got cling film on it. But I've got a tuna, sweet corn, and cucumber sandwich, some crisps, and some cucumber. But I'm going to do a bit of makeup now, I think. Okay, so I just did my makeup. I just did some under eyeliner and some eyeshadow. When I get the brace done, I won't be able to film then or like when I'm with the orthodontist because that would just be awkward. My appointment's at 2.15, then razors at 3.15, so we have those in our slots. My friend told me that they have like a mouth guard and they like have this vacuum type thing. It's, mm, it's kind of freaking me out a bit, but I mean, last time I had to get one of those moulds. They put like this like mould thing in your mouth and then like it had a, made like a mould of your teeth. And they put it literally at the back of my throat on the top and I was like gagging <laughs> in the side. It didn't taste good as well. It's like putty. I changed my mind because it was just, it didn't look very good together to be honest. Got my M&M shirt on and just some leggings. So now I'm all changed, I have my drawer, I'm gonna take my hair out now. Oh, I didn't even think it would curl. Wait, that's kind of cool. A little bit wet. <laughs> nice though. That's my hair. I can't tell if I'm excited or not excited. Okay, everyone. Update. We are leaving. Got Vaseline and some headphones here on to my phone. I've also got a drink of water. So I'm ready to go. We're leaving now. So now I'm going to transfer onto my phone. Okay, I'm on my phone now. So we are about to leave to get my braces on. Kind of scared to be honest. Um, I'm also kind of nervous what I'm gonna look like. Cause like, what if I look really bad with it on? I don't know. Everyone says that, but then they get used to it. Everyone's in the car. I'm off to get braces. <laughs> This is what they look like. I got them in pink. I got them in pink. It's like a bubblegum pink. It's the next day, it's Friday. I've done school work. I've just done some um, homework this morning. I woke up quite late. I didn't end up filming yesterday because I was in the orthodontist and I got my braces on and it was all fine. But like the wire was sticking into my gum and it was really uncomfortable. So the lady had to fix that. And it was kind of just like that all night. It was really uncomfortable for me. They were really irritating me yesterday. It was quite painful and it was aching really early for me. Like last night it was terrible. I didn't even sleep that much. It's been 24 hours and they did say that the aching would be bad now. But the aching was the worst this morning, I think. Or last night, sometime in the middle of that. Um, but I got the wire sorted out. And the lady gave us some equipment and all of that for the teeth. So I'm going to show you them now. So the first thing, they said to buy some mouthwash i got this colgate flory guard one and it's like supposed to keep your teeth all clean and all that and i use that i also got this toothbrush i have an electric one but i way prefer these ones then i got these stuff so this one's like a little toothbrush type thing just to get in the braces because i can't get in with a toothbrush i'm normally the fastest eater in my family but it takes me about half an hour to finish food so like this morning i had soup and a yogurt literally for breakfast because <laughs> i didn't fancy anything else and then finally they gave me this wax for whenever it's like rubbing on my gum or whenever it's uncomfortable. Just some wax. Apparently it's made out of vegetables. So like if you swallow it, then it's not bad for you. I don't know if you can hear it or not, but I have kind of like a lisp type, this lisp type thing. I'm still adjusting to them. It's kind of a bit irritating. But the people, the orthodontist said that I will have to have these braces on for about a year or two. My teeth weren't that bad. They just said it's better if I get them on, if I want them straight, so if I get them on. But I think it'll probably be a year and a half. 
I think I'll have them on for. So this is what I'll be looking like. From now on, you'll be seeing me with braces. But yeah, they should get better from now. It's not that bad today anymore. That's basically the whole update. A lot of people did message me after I got them on. And you guys asked me, does it hurt? Because some of you are getting them. So I'm just going to explain how they put the brace on. Did it hurt? And answer all the questions that you guys actually DM me some. Um, so the first thing about the braces is I went first, actually. And what happened is... She made my mouth all dry, which is kind of annoying. And people say they put this mouth guard on it, it makes your lips bleed. That is not the case for me whatsoever. I had, it was kind of stretchy mouth guard. It wasn't that bad at all. I got to wear these cool glasses and the chair was so comfy. So the worst part about it was the achiness and like how sensitive my teeth are now. Like I can't bite that well. Like chewing is really hard to do. So I, that's why I had soup and stuff. Um, but yeah, for the next seven days, it'll probably be like this, but then I'll get used to them and I won't notice them. I don't want to keep pink forever so next time i go i want to get a different color but i don't know what color i'm thinking blue or lilac please comment what color you think i should get next so i was about to film the outro but then this came this is the cutest top ever it's got little strawberries on it and i love it i'm definitely gonna wear this probably tomorrow his nugget he's been shedding and i think he finished i think he has some on his feet which i help him with tonight So basically we just got Nugget out and he's just walking around right now. He has some shed on him which we're just trying to help him get off now because it must be really annoying. I don't want to keep it on his toes because his toes could fall off. So this is my bed all pulled out. It's a double bed from Ikea, which you can just pull out. It's normally a day bed with only like one half of a single bed, but now it's a double. I like to have it on weekends because it's chillaxing. So the time right now is 8.08 and I'm probably just gonna relax in bed for a bit. Update on my braces. Uh, they're getting better. I don't have an achiness in them right now. I think it's going down, but they're still quite sensitive. Tonight, I'm probably gonna watch some YouTube. I'm going to brush my teeth in a minute as well. So that's the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed seeing the first few days of me having braces on. Getting them on was not bad at all. The aftermath of it is painful, but not really bad, to be honest. And it gets better, obviously. The first shout out goes to Mia Gwen. You were always one of the first people to comment on my my YouTube when I post a video, so thank you so much for that. The second shout out goes to Samaya Fatima. I'm really sorry if I said your name wrong. You are always commenting really nice stuff on my YouTube videos, so thank you so much for that too. I can't end this video without thanking my notification squad and oh squad, I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching my video if you got all the way here. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!